Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Jurassic Park the Game. If you haven't checked out any of the previous episodes, highly recommend it before we get going here with our man Billy Yoder. Uh, just to give you a quick summary, they were flying in their helicopter, they saw the, the little fire, and I think we can see the fire over here somewhere, right? Oh yeah, he's right, right there. Um, that the, the Hardings and Nima, well, started as they are making their way north, so they are being sought after as rescuees uh and billy and oscar and decaf are, are trying to help them out uh so let's do ourselves a little exploring here let's see what billy sees that might be different than what uh our leaves, previous three saw stems if they came this way they didn't leave a trace all right so nothing there he's gonna see the blood on this log that nema left behind from that big old wound she blood has here. this just keeps getting better quite a bit of blood all right, he's gonna check out these berries no here. Trail, no broken leaves, nothing. And then it looks like the last place we have. Oh, we got got something here, but I want to go over here and check those eggs out, uh, and see what he does with these eggs over here. Got some here. fresh tracks here, Oscar. I'm guessing dinos. Ooh. Oh boy. I'll bet that's not going to go over well with Mom. No, it's not. And we got some quick reaction times here. Um, let's get out of here. That Dilaposaurus is not looking friendly. Another dodge here. Get out of the way there. Ooh, dodge that spit. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Oscar, where you at, my man? I need some help. Let's get our gun. Oops. Come on. Ooh. Ouch. Good kick there. Come on. Come on. Got it. All right. Ooh, Oscar, my man, with the kick. You okay? Oscar, thank God. I thought I was a goner. I told you to be careful. <laughs> what the hell is that thing, anyway? Whatever it is, I'm gonna kill it. Whoa, whoa, calm it. down, big guy. It's over. It's over. Let it go. Look at Probably it. I cracked its ribcage. It's not gonna hurt anyone now. Hey, thanks. Anyway, I looked everywhere. Couldn't find any sign of a trail. That way. The bone chaser? Is that what it said? You realize we're headed straight towards a cliff, don't you? There's no way down from here. We're going to have to find another way around, which will take us, I don't know, at least a half a day. There's an old goat path that will take us down. Hmm. How she know that? It's an interesting uh, statement. Oh, Bone Shaker. Bone Shaker. What the? Oh, wow. How can you tell me about any rides like this, Dad? Uh, didn't know. The rides aren't well, ready. Well, none of the rides are ready for the public. I, I didn't want to get your hopes up. That path was ancient. Carved into the stone. It survived storms, earthquakes. Look, it's, it's too late to go around, and it's too dangerous to go back the way we came. Just use the radio. Contact the rescue team. It is our best chance of survival. Down there. We can ride this contraption to get us down to that exit. We're gonna ride it? That lever. It looks like it would set the tracks to stop at that exit. Yes, but that's the emergency lever. Besides, it's obviously not ready for people to use. Well, it looks like the only way. You find us a safe way down, or I'll throw you down. <laughs> if I can get the power on, I might be able to set the, the ride to maintenance mode from up here. What's maintenance mode? It'll switch the tracks, same as the emergency lever. Basically, it lets the employees use the tracks for work and repairs instead of for fun. But I don't see any cars on the main track, Dad. Get the power on. We're still going? Yeah, it's getting dark. We cannot go back the way we came, and it sounds like the dinosaurs are getting ready to hunt. Are they hunting us? Well, they're still a good ways off, but we shouldn't stick around here for long. Listen, if we're going to make it to the coast, we are going to have to work together to make it there alive. Understood? You, come with me. We're going to get some cars on the track. All right, so we got to get cars on the track and turn the power on. There. Stand by the lever. 
You're gonna help me get the cars on the track. Hey, Dad! What are these cars for? They don't have any seats. My guess is those are utility carts. We gotta get them off the track and load in some cars we can actually sit in. Nah, just right on the right on the other cars. All right, Jess, what do we got going on here? Uh, take a peek at this. Move the scaffolding. How am I supposed to do that? It's like way too heavy. Uh. All right, so let's have Nima turn this on. Okay, so that spins like that. That's how they pick cars. It's a two. So they got numbers on the front. Get the cars onto the track in the right order. You can fit up to four cars on the track at once. So we got the first car up front, so we know that's good. That's two, three, so we gotta get those off. Um, so we should probably, let's think this through, spin it one more time, back three off. Um, so that'll go, let's say, in there. Spin it again, I can put one of the maintenance cars in there. Wait, no, hold on. Um, no, let's back. Three would go there, maintenance car, so that one's full. Spin it again, another maintenance car in there. Um, but then that puts two there. Okay, so we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to do some switching at some point. So let's go ahead and push, um, how do we get the scaffold Let's go, out? we need that scaffolding off the track. Yeah, uh, I don't think it's going anywhere unless you're way stronger than you look. Just push it. I can't, you push it. All right, so how do we, how do we, um, the crane? Ooh, let's use the crane. All right, let's move that scaffolding first. Okay, we got Jerry. Hey, looks like the crane is functional. Good. Now do something useful with it. <laughs> all right, so let's take a peek. What all can we do? We need to go this way a little bit. And then we'll drop the, the hook down. And then Jess, hopefully she'll be able to grab that and hook the hook onto the the scaffolding for us. Let's go here. All right, Jess, use the hook hey, for me, please. What about this? Can you use it for anything? Fishing scaffolding. Attach it to the scaffolding. We can use the crane to lift it off the tracks. All right. Stand back, Jess. There we go. Okay. Oops. Yikes. All right. Um, so maybe if we back three in, that, that, and then let's do three, move two up. We can do, okay, I know what I'm going to do. I have it in my head. I got it in my head, but now we probably need to get the power on. So let's go to here and see if Jerry can get the power on for us first. Judging by the layout of this place, I'd say the power station must be over in that area. Stay there. You go. Okay, so like, what am I looking for? The power station. Look for doors. Big gray box right behind you. All right. Well, for funsies, let's just move some of this other stuff. Hmm. Nothing here. What? That's not a power station. Well, I want to see the how how tall the ride thing. Jess is probably barely tall enough. Eh. Yeah, she's got a good foot. Yeah, cause Jurassic Park is all about safety. Heyo. All right, and that leaves us this one here. Why can't I get the, there we go. All right, and let's move this board out of the way as well. This should be our power station here. Big old electric symbol there in the bottom right corner. <sighs> An even bigger electric Dad, symbol I found right there. Doors. Is this the power thingy? That looks like it. Open them up and throw the main switch. All right, Jess, go ahead and open that for me, please. The doors are locked. Well, I don't have a key. That's cool. I'll just bust the windows. Um, of a rock? Okay. I thought we were going to have to use the crane to hook it to the, the door. This should get me into those doors. Oh, I missed it. Dang it. Shoot. All right, let's try that again. Ugh, all right. Second time's a charm. This should get me into those doors. 
Am I going too early? I must be going too early. Shoot. All right, third time's the charm. Cross our fingers and toes here. This should get me into those doors. There we go. I was going too early. Awesome. Third time's the charm indeed. Okay. Um, so does that open it now? Okay. I, I can reach inside, but what am I looking for? Jess, there are two large switches inside, but you probably won't be able to reach them like that. Um, maybe I do have to use the crane. Okay, she's going to do the same thing. Gotta get past these doors somehow. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Let's go back to the crane and we're going to slide it this way. Can I go more to the left? We can. There we go. And then we're going to drop the drop the hook again. Maybe hit Jess in the head. No, okay, and then let's switch over to Jess again. All right, grab the hook, and let's Jess, pull these doors off. Jess, be careful. Off. What are you doing with that hook? Bungee jump rocks, doors. I've got a plan. You're gonna love this. Okay, Dad, your turn. Everyone get back. Awesome. All right, um, so we need to do probably, is it the, le probably the lever first, then the switch? Great override. Okay, and then throw the switch. Okay, that's one. And then throw that, please. And we got power. Welcome to the bone shaker. Oh, that's not good. Looks like we have power. Whoa, cool. Okay. So that was what back. Billy and Oscar heard. But we got friends. What's that? I don't know. Predators. They're still too far away for me to tell which ones, thank goodness. Not a T-Rex though, right? Definitely not a T-Rex. Nope, something smaller and a little more agile. Okay, uh, so let's spin this one more time. We'll back three in here. So go ahead and- I can't fit any more cars in the track. I'll have to move some off first. Yeah, so back, back three off. Perfect. All right, Nima, spin that. And then back one of the service cars off. Perfect. All right, and then spin this. And then I wanna do, so if we do two here, Right, and then three, then we can spin it all the way around, back those off, back that off. All right, uh, so let's go ahead and load two on. Aha, it works. It okay. does. That's pretty cool, actually. All right, and then spin this, and we'll put three on, go around to the empty one. All right, load There's that There's no on. open slot to move the car into. Come on, I clicked on the wrong one. It's a little counterintuitive the way you guys have it set up. All right, and then bring three on. And then spin that again. Spin that again. All right, now we can back both of them off. Back two off. All right, there we go. Spin that. Oh, I love this puzzle. It's a straightforward puzzle, but it's it's nice. All right, so then we should be able to spin and spin, and then we'll load these cars on. There's no open slot to move the Dang car it. into. I know. I clicked it on the wrong one again. I still think you guys have it backwards, but what do I know? All right, car number two. And car number three. I think that's right. Hey, the cars are all on the loading track. Now it's up to you. What are you going to do if the rescue team shows up? What? I mean, they probably heard that noise. Let's not worry about the rescue team right now. All right, so now we got to figure out how to get it to the main track, which I would say it's probably this one. All right, Jer Bear. What do you got for us? 
Okay, these, these are the main controls for the roller coaster. I should be able to set it to maintenance mode from here. Oh, wait, hold on. Did we do it? Okay, the cars are properly aligned on the track. We should be ready to start. So, maintenance mode? Switched well, over. that ought to do it. The ride should stop and let us out at the maintenance exit, instead of doing the normal loop. All right, well, before we hop on that coaster, we've been going for about 20 minutes now, and I think this is a great cliffhanger to stop at before we take a nice little roller coaster ride down to the bottom. But I suspect that might not exactly be what happens. Uh, we've had quite a bit of foreshadowing so far in this episode. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it. Uh, give me a subscribe here at Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get us all this Jurassic Park content on a, you know, orderly fashion on time, what I normally say. I just screwed that up, but that's okay. Um, and then leave me a comment on down below on what you think one Nima said and what's going to happen next. Uh, are we going to make it to the bottom? Are we going to have some dinosaurs pop up? We know it's not a T-Rex. Um, I have my sinking suspicions on what it might be, uh, especially because we haven't really seen it yet. So, you know, that might be a little hint for you. Uh, if not, I'll see you guys in the next Jurassic Park The Game video.